Some examples of why you may need a second opinion before receiving a dental implant are the following. For example, this patient shows that the roots are too close together for a dental implant. Too close. Secondly, the bone is too thin for a dental implant. Third, the patient has osteoporosis, which is a negative factor as far as placing the dental implant. As a result, we recommended braces for this patient to widen the space and allow placement of the implant without damage to the tooth roots. The implant was placed very precisely utilizing our advanced technology and not damaging the adjacent roots. And so, if you're concerned with any of your treatment recommendations, please call us for a second opinion.